Hello! So the WWE 2K14 trailer was released this morning, or yesterday for some of you, and I'm here to dissect what was uh, happening, what was going on there. And there's a lot of things that I've dissected that um, you probably wouldn't usually see. A lot of you wouldn't have seen or noticed what I've seen. Uh, so I'm just here to show you and share with you what I've seen. Here we go, this is the dissection of WWE 2K14. So the first thing I sort of notice um, is the fact that it's not just purely Attitude Era and it's also not just um, Current Era it's a bit of both so I'm guessing they've got rid of story like a sort of story mode like Wrestlemania or Attitude Era and they've just sort of focused on Universe Mode that's my guess because that makes sense with the whole Attitude Era of Superstars and Current Era of Superstars because you can have them in your Attitude Era in your Universe Mode sorry so yeah let's move on okay first of all uh, the obvious thing is that Ryback's picking up two superstars here, and what I've noticed is that they are not real superstars. They look to me as if they're created superstars, uh, made to look like jobbers, I guess. So there's nothing really to look at there. But I, I need to. I can't stress enough how amazing that is. The fact you can pick up two superstars. I'm guessing you can do that with like the attitude adjustment and all the other moves as well. But we'll see. But even that alone is amazing. Also, the uh, stage for Raw looks a lot, lot uh, better. It's the current uh, stage, obviously. So, obviously, it looks amazing. Um, yeah, so that's an update. Okay, here we go. You can throw a superstar in the air. A bit unrealistic, but a lot of fun. So, my guess is that you can do that and then do any move you want. And Shawn Michaels is clearly doing a, a uh, switch in music here. But... It, I don't I can't tell but I'm gonna guess and say you can do the switchy music from anywhere so you can miss and you can you don't have to be in the right position to do it you know and if it connects it does this lovely little uh, oh my god moment style animation uh, a new um, a new zigzag which looks amazing and here's an interesting thing um, it looks like John Cena picks up um, Ziggler quite quickly and also even though you can't really see because it cuts uh, in between The Rock and Cena, but it looks to me like it's a fast FU, um, like a realistic one, like in a pay-per-view match, you know? So that's a, a massive addition, I guess. So basically, what I can confirm there is Stone Cold, The Rock, John Cena, Dolph Ziggler, uh, Shawn Michaels, um, Randy Savage, and is that it? I'm just trying to check. I think that's it, really. Um, so that's 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 lovely. I can't tell if the let me just check. I, f I can't tell if the um, the rock bottom is new. I don't think it is. The Stone Cold Stunner definitely isn't. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. And there's a lot that I've dissected, including the <clears throat> just stressing on the attitude adjustment, which looks fantastic. Um, and it just I can't tell, but I don't know if when people land. Uh, when, you, when you land a move, I can't tell if it's a different animation, if like the physics are a lot, a lot different. Maybe, I don't know. Um, so that's what we've gathered from that. So it, look, it looks lovely, it looks amazing. Um, so that's one to watch, and I hope there's more released soon. And that's my dissection of WWE 2K14. Thank you very much.